Hey Yoshi, how are you doing? Alright, let's see. So it is currently let's see. So I got a new webcam. I, I'm trying it out for the first time right now. Um yeah. So let me know if there's like any problems or anything with it. There's like these like weird lines that are coming through. I'm not really sure what to do with that. I might need to contact the seller to see if they can fix that. So yeah, it looks like it's picking up on stream. I think I'm going to do it with, should I keep, yeah, this is like glitching out. I'm just going to turn off the camera. This isn't really working. I, I think I need to contact the seller to see if they can fix that for me. That's too bad. Um, but yeah, we're going to play SimCity for the first time. Let's see. Select server. I am in North America East. Alright, let's make sure we get the game capture for SimCity. Ooh, is it gonna work? Hey, there it is. I've never played this game before, but I've always played Sims, so hopefully it'll go over pretty well. Well, I'm gonna need to like up the resolution. Hey Yoshi! Yeah, so I got a new webcam, but it's like glitching out and it has all these lines coming through it, so I'm just gonna turn off the cam and just do, um, just play the game and talk. Yeah, it's okay. I think I'm just gonna contact the seller and see if I can get them to like refund it or send me a new one or something. My plan is to have this new one. It has really good quality. It's 4K, the image is really sharp, and it's like has like ultra wide so you can get like more of the setup in the background. Um, yeah, but I think this one might be like a little broken or something because there's a bunch of lines going through the back. So I was planning on having this one for my face and then having a setup in the background and using my old cam for Pepper, which I thought would be so cute. So, oh, I'm the mayor. Okay, let's see. I love Sims. We should play Sims on stream sometime. I, I don't think I've ever done that. I think it's because I'm a little worried about playing Sims. <laughs> it, gets, it gets a little crazy. All right, so I actually have about an hour and a half or so that I can stream with you guys. Petting goats? Ooh, okay. I've never played a city builder like this. But I'm curious to try it out. I saw someone actually playing this on YouTube uh, yesterday, and I was like, this looks like so much fun. You've never played Sims? Oh, okay, I've, I've played Sims 2, 3, and 4. I'm very, very excited for Sims 5, because that one is co-op, and that's what every Sims player has ever wanted. Like, All right. Welcome, Alley Cat 2496 You're the new mayor of Summer Shoals. The previous mayor did a terrible job and was run out of town. Summer Shoals needs your help. Let's get familiar with the basic camera. Oh, I zoom in, zoom out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I know this. We're we're not new to Sims here. We know what to do. All right. Sims need to do things to improve their lives. There's a sim at town hall that needs your help. Look at this cute little. Oh, they're having a little protest. That's actually really cute. Hey, <laughs> look at them. Look at them running around. Look at the bodyguards. What are they protesting? All right, let's see. Let's see what we can do. Oh, go for it. Oh, they're speaking Simlish. I love that. I'm Eva Stanton, your city administrator. Welcome to Summer Shoals. We really need your help. You may have no noticed the protesters. Our last mayor left the city in a terrible state. We're hoping you can fix it up for us. First, we need to connect to the outside world. We're cut off. Nobody can move in. Please fix our highway. I'll try my best. All right, let's see over here. Oh, that's really weird. How did that even happen? Roads are purchased from the roads menu. They carry traffic, power, water, and sewage through your city. Click to open the roads menu. Okay, 
roads, wider roads like avenues can handle more traffic. We'll need an avenue for this vital connection to the region highway. Select the medium density avenue road tool. Ta-da! All right, we did it. Great, now Sims can come and go over the highway. Sims will live, work, and shop in your city. Your city cannot grow without Sims and they can't get here without a road. As your city grows, you can control traffic and building density by choosing which roads to lay and by upgrading your existing roads. Eva wants to thank you. Head back to Town Hall. Click the speech bubble to speak with her. Well done, Mayor. Every town needs a connection to the highway. Now construction trucks can build new houses and residents can move in. Once they get settled, our residents can use the highway to commute to Lucky Shores. Thanks so much. Now that you're connected to the highway, there is demand for more houses in your city. People want to move here. These demand bars tell you what your sims want. Sometimes your residents will ask for help. Look for speech bubbles around your city to see what your residents need. Hi Mayor, you decide where Sims can build houses by creating residential zones. Sims will build houses and move into new, resi move into new residential zones themselves. Could you zone more residential areas? My brother Cliff wants to move in, but I don't want him moving in with me. Makes sense. Okay, let's take a look. So that's the only residential zone that we have, and we need to make some more. So maybe we can place it alongside the roads. Maybe we can make it on this side of the road. Okay, here comes a construction truck now to build new wealth houses, new low wealth houses. Nicer neighborhoods attract higher wealth sims. When you're done watching, click okay. I wanna see this, this looks really cute. <laughs> Yay! Okay, remember, to get Sims to move into your city, you need to connect the highway and zone residential. Your Sims will occasionally share their thoughts about with you. They will help you gauge how your Sims think you're doing at running the city. Zoom in to see your Sims' thoughts. This will help you get, gauge how well your Sims think you're running the city. Here's one now. Okay, right, let's see. Well, Mayor, Sims are moving to Summer Shoals, but they don't want to live next to this. Rubble lowers residential land value and is a fire mix too. Click the, click to select the bulldoze tool. So we're gonna click the rubble. Don't need that. I think that's it. Okay, there we go. Things are looking better already. Now construction crews will build shops on this block and land values will improve. With new residential development and new shops opening up, Sims are moving in. Let's look at your population. This is the population panel. It looks like your residential population has increased. This panel helps you track your city's growth and overall wealth. Okay, let's close it. So we have 28,129 in the region with 5,134 in the city. And we have no one visiting right now. So our population source is 100% from locals and our population wealth right now is almost entirely low income with a little bit of medium and no high. Let's take a look. There's a factory manager who wants to talk to you about bringing more jobs to Summer Shoals. Click on the speech bubble to speak with him. Generic mill. Hi Mayor, this factory is my pride and joy. Sure it's polluting, but we're job creators. New residents in town means new workers, so this town needs some new jobs. Residents won't want to live next to factories, but there's still plenty of room for more industry. Please zone for more industrial and commercial buildings. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and zone for that now. We have an unemployment crisis. That's not good. So we need to zone some more. It says factories create freight that, sh that it ships to shops. If there isn't enough demand, the factory will go out of business. We need to draw an industrial zone. Um, why don't we drag it along? Let's see. 
Maybe along the street. Remember, zone industrial to attract factories. Factories lower land value, but industry will create goods and make your city grow. Okay. Commercial zones are where your sims work, shop and work. Okay, we need to make some more commercial. Commercial shops take freight deliveries from factories and sell goods to residents and tourists. So we need to make some more shops. I think we should do that on the side of the street. That was easy. Remember to zone commercial to attract shops. Residents spend the money that they earn from their jobs at shops, which makes them happy. Okay, you control time, llama speed. Okay, click one more time. Now that you've got more business open, let's look at your treasury. This shows the number of simoleons you can spend right now. We have 359,940 um, simoleons. Here is where you can see your city's revenue. The number shows how much money your city is earning per hour. If this turns red, you know you're in trouble. We're looking good so far. Okay, with Sims moving in, and business is opening, you should see an increase in the city's income. Let's have a look at the city's books, the budget panel. Okay, here we can see all of our income and expenses. Keep your income higher than your expenses to stay in the black. Right now, we're, we have too much expenses with power, government, education, and parks. When the board is green, the budget's clean. Upgrade to a city hall to control taxes for R, C, and I independently. Okay. Some of those protesters has been, have been grumbling that taxes are too high. We have enough simoleons now, we can placate the masses by lowering taxes. Okay. Everyone who is upset about high taxes should have one less thing to complain about now. Let's close. Eva's been clearing her throat all day, or maybe she's just thirsty. Let's see what it is. Mayor, we used to have a water tower, but it was destroyed in a storm just a few months back. The town's getting thirsty, but they don't like the idea of relying on another water tower. I have just the solution. Lucky Shores, the big city just to the west, has plenty of water. Head to the region to make a deal with Lucky Shores. Okay, let's go. Summer Shoals is not the only city in the region. Let's take a look at the entire region and see who our neighbors are. Ooh, okay. I think this game is actually co-op. Okay. This is your city, Summer Shoals. Each city in a region can be run by a different mayor, or one mayor can run them all. Each region has a great work site. Several of the cities in the region can collaborate on a massive project to benefit the region. This airport brings in a lot of tourists. Off in the distance is Lucky Shores, the nearest big city. Their mayor, Chet Kano, Kino, has specialized Lucky Shores in gambling. It's quite a bustling tourist hotspot. Lucky Shores has way more water than they need, so let's buy some of it. We're going to click the water button, and we're going to buy this. That's it. Now we're buying the water that we need from Lucky Shores. As our water needs grow, we'll automatically buy the water that we need as long as Lucky Shores can supply it. Neighboring cities can sell or give resources or services to each other. We should be set now, so let's head back to Summer Shoals. There it is, flowing under the roads. Water is essential for your cities. Without water, businesses will close and the sims will move away. Lucky Shores helped us with our water problem. Now Eva is dealing with power shortage. She thinks we can solve ourselves. Your Honor, Summer Shoals has a cold flower plant, but the previous mayor turned off coal deliveries to save a buck. Now we've run out of coal and the plant has shut down. Since you've connected to the highway, you just need to turn on coal deliveries and we can start buying coal from the global market. Okay, this is the coal power plant that provides power to Summer Shoals. It works well, but right now we're out of coal, so the city isn't powered. So we're going to select this, and it says the coal power plant buys the coal it needs from the global market. Let's turn on deliveries. Perfect. Now we're up and running. Look, there's the little people. They're going to work. That's so cute. There you go. This coal truck is arriving to deliver coal to our power plant. Once it arrives, the power plant will start to deliver power to the city. This is so cute. 
and we're up and running. Now we have power. We're paying for the coal deliveries, but our city needs power. You can see the power as yellow traveling along your roads. Cities without power will stop working and cities will abandon them. So remember to plop a power plant or buy power from your neighbors in the region. We're no longer in the dark, but now Eve is worried about crime. We should check with her. Mayor, I'm up to my neck in complaints and calls. We had to close the police station to save some money. Most people have been on their best behavior, but we've seen a recent uptick in crime. If you ask me, I think they're coming in from Lucky Shores, but it's impolite to speculate. Best to open that police station. There's nothing wrong with this old police station. It's just closed to save a few simoleons. Click the police station once to select it. And then we can open the police station and people will... Um, arrive to work as police. Good thing you've got the police station working. There's a crime in progress right now. These criminals are up to no good. Are you drag racing in my city? Excuse me. Oh! What is going on here? Educated and unemployed sims may turn to a life of crime. This starts out as simple shoplifting and left unchecked it can develop into more troublesome crimes. Get those crooks! Police respond to crimes in progress and patrol the neighborhood around the station to keep an eye out for criminals. Hey, what's that smell? Eva has an idea. Head to town hall. Alright. Mayor, this town stinks. It's all the garbage. We've been relying on Lucky Shores to provide garbage collection, and it's been a while since it's been collected. I gave Mayor Kino over there a call, and I think I convinced him to send a truck over. We don't have full coverage, but the occasional garbage truck should help. You should see that the truck is coming. Okay, here it comes. Neighboring cities can share system coverage for city services like fire, health, crime, and garbage. We're going to select the garbage truck, and we're going to follow. It's fortunate that Lucky Shores has provided us with one of their garbage trucks. Click the garbage menu button. Here you can see that Lucky Shores provides our gar garbage coverage. Cities can make bonus income by providing their services to other cities in the region. We don't need our, our own garbage dump thanks to Lucky Shores help. Every morning one of their garbage trucks will show up to take our garbage away. St there still seems to be a foul scent in the air. We should check in with um, Eva. Mayor, I don't think that stink was only from garbage. We have another smelly problem running right under our roads. Sewage is just pooling in the pipes und ew, under the roads. If it doesn't have somewhere to go, it'll start backing up in people's backyards. We need a sewage outflow pipe. It's not the cleanest solution, but we need to send that sewage somewhere. Okay, let's get one started. So we can see all of the waste sloshing around in the pipes in this view. That's really gross. So we need to put it somewhere, put it in a remote corner of town. Um, that's outside the city's borders. We don't want it blowing into the city. We have wind. So maybe we don't want it going in the ocean. Hmm. This is not good. Um, Well, I really don't like going in the ocean, but it's also like gonna blow all over the town. Um, hmm. this isn't a very good option. Maybe we can extend the road here a little bit and see if we can plop it. system has data maps that graphically show you information about your city. Let's see what impact this is having. Click the ground pollution map button. That's disgusting. Wait, where is that? Oh, there we go. Ew. Okay. The sewage outflow pipe is adding ground pollution here. This will lower land values near the po pollution, preventing wealthy sims from moving there. Let's close the data map for now. It looks like we're needed. 
there's smoke coming from our neighbor's house. I think it's on fire. We need a fire station. We need to put this fire out before it spreads. We need a fire station quick. Click to select the fire station. And we need to put click a row next to the fire station. Um, I think I could go here. Yeah, why not? Okay, let's get that done. That's a good spot. As soon as your fire station is staffed up, firefighters will hop in a fire truck and rush to put that fire out. Industrial, abandoned, and rubbled buildings and accumulated garbage increase fire risk. Fire stations put out your fires, but avoid the causes of fire to make them more effective. Seems there are less protesters, but some of them are shouting about schools now. Let's talk to Eva. Hey, welcome back, Oshi. Good job with that fire, Mayor. I've got a new problem that I think you can solve. Some area parents are concerned. Our schools are overcrowded. We can't teach all the kids without more classrooms. If we don't educate our residents, our local industry will stay in the dark ages. Let's teach those kids. Okay. The town's grade school doesn't have enough classrooms. Schools can help our kids grow up to be safe, law-abiding sims. We're going to click the grade school. Um, we can use modules to improve our buildings. These are useful for increasing capacity, improving responsiveness, increasing efficiency, and more. So we're going to edit this, and we're going to add some classrooms. We'll also get some more teachers. So I think I kind of like the look of it going right here. I think that's cute. Okay, nice. Educated kids will be more responsible. They will commit fewer crimes, cause less fires, and get injured less often. So we're going to close out of there. And kids living in each house can go to grade schools for primary education. Be sure that schools have enough capacity to handle all the students in our city. Ooh, we're losing money per hour, so we got to take a look at that. All of our sims have their own homes, go to work, and try to make themselves happy. You can click on any sim to see what they're doing. Burning off some energy came from City Park. What else? How about this kid? Going to play at the park came from foster residents. Oh, it's really sad. Not talking to strangers on the way home came from City Park. Well, I'm glad you're not talking to strangers. Mommy said to come straight home. Yeah, listen here, Mom. Gotta be home before curfew. Okay. Your improvements have really turned this town around. Let's have a look at just how happy everyone is. We're gonna open the government menu. Like all systems, government has its own set of data maps. The happiness map shows how happy your residents are throughout the city. Okay. This is our happy map. It looks really good. Okay, it says it's not perfect, but certainly much better than before. Sims are happy now that we've provided basic utilities and services. I mean, they're a four out of five. They look like they're doing great. I know, right? <laughs> okay, happy Sims will stay in our city to work and pay taxes. Medium and high wealth Sims will leave the city if they're unhappy. Let's close the happiness map. On menus throughout SimCity, you'll find these information icons. Scroll your mouse cursor over the eye icon. Okay, that's a lot of information. Let's see. It says City Hall allows you to set tax rates. Each city hall upgrade grants you a choice of one department module. Many city hall departments grant access to more buildings for all cities in the region. Government buildings increase nearby land value. Buildings start as low as end city, but they can grow if they are kept happy slash profitable. Building, um, a building will only grow if the road uh, it is on is big enough to permit the traffic. Click on an individual building to see its progress towards the next density level. Density is the building size. Land value re relates to its wealth level. If a building loses happiness slash profit, it will eventually go abandoned, and an abandoned building may revive if its problems are resolved. Okay, that's pretty helpful. Looks like most of the protesters have dispersed now. Aoife's got one last favor to ask. Lucky Shores has been good for summer shoals. Many of our workers commute there to work in Lucky Shores casinos. Lucky Shores is quite a bustling gambling city. You should go there and check where our workers are commuting. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look to see how many workers we have commuting to Lucky Shores. The workers menu can show you how many workers are commuting. And there's data maps in this area too. Okay, the large area arrow shows the direction our commuting workers are traveling to Lucky Shores. Okay. 
Okay, let's check out Lucky Shores and see how Mayor Chet Keno has laid out his city. Let's take a look. We're gonna visit. Yeah, I kind of like it though. I think once we get the game flowing, we won't have to rely as much on the data. We'll just kind of be able to do what we need to do. But it's our first time playing, so I'm not really sure what I'm doing yet. So I am going to rely on the data until I have a better hang on things. It is. Yeah, it's, it's, I'm, I'm interested so far. Okay. Spectating cities. Nice city, huh? Lucky Shores is a tourist hotspot. There's a strip of casinos along the cliffs, high-rise hotels, and loads of mass transit. Mayor Kino has made Lucky Shores a gambling city. Specialized cities can focus on improving their cities to help the region. Any mayor can elect to specialize to improve both their city and help the region. Let's have a look. What is in the sky? What is going on right now? What the frick? Is this like an alien invasion? What is meteors? Oh my god. Bruh. Well, that's unfortunate. Now what? There's more? What is this, 9-11? What is going on? Oh my gosh. It's all our fault. We need to get out of here. We're gonna get blamed. Why are they saying congratulations? A natural, a, a major disaster happened in the town next to us. Okay. Um... Wow, that's terrible news about Lucky Shores, Mayor. I hope there wasn't too much damage. I sent a fire truck over there as soon as I heard. You've done a remarkable job rejuvenating Summer Shoals. It's great to have you around, but I think I can take it from here. You should go start a fresh region and build your very own city from scratch. Oh, we've been evicted. Okay. Oh, this was just a getting started scenario. Oh, now we can go play. So, if anyone actually has this, we can play together. There's multiplayer mode, and we can all start a city. That'd be so cute. Um, until that happens, uh, or if anyone says that they would like to play, I'm going to go ahead and keep this in single player. But let me know if you're interested in starting a multiplayer sim city. Okay, let's try this for the first time. I think it would be pretty... Let's see, we have Cape Trinity. Ooh. Whitewater Valley. That's really pretty. I like that a lot. Reflection Toll. Serenity Key. Ooh, it's got a... their island chains. Rambling Badlands. A Verdant Jungle. Desolation. Viridian Woods. Oh, I like that one a lot, too. Sunrunner Bay. Ooh, that one's really cool. I like that as well. Discovery Delta, Horizon Archipelago, Titan Gorge, Edgewater Bay, and Granite Lake. Oh, I like that a lot too. Hmm. I think for our first time playing, I'm going to go with Whitewater Valley. Wait, these are actually really small. I... one smaller. Maybe we should start with something smaller for our first time. This one has one great works and five cities. Let's try this one first. What should we name it? Something like with the mountain 
Mountains and the River. Captain, Captain Valley. Okay, we're gonna name it Captain Valley. Okay, um, let's create an empty site to claim a city this region. I think I'm gonna go perhaps this one right here. Wait, what about this one? Oh. Oh, this one doesn't have very good natural resources. Okay, what about this? Okay, actually, let's, let's, mm, this one doesn't, mm. This one actually has some of everything. This one is missing something. This one's missing a lot. Um. All right, we'll go here actually, in Breakman's Folly. Okay, let's go ahead and play. The Roman Luck Casino is now unlocked and ready to use. Let's see. Oh, I got a charging station. I forgot about that. Okay. Ooh. Okay, let's take a look. So this is our main highway over here. We need to connect it somehow. So I think we should start, oh, okay, these are optional, scroll over, all right, we, thank you, draw a road from the highway. So here's our high, whoopsie, ah, there we go, all right, um, ooh, I like this too, there's like this little, this bridge that comes out as well. I think that we should draw a road from probably over here and let's start out with some low density roads because we don't have a lot of money right now there's a lot we need to get started with. So we're going to go up and let's go over. I want to make some neighborhoods. Wait, that's uneven. I don't like that. Can I undo? How do I undo? I guess it's just the bulldoze. Alright, we're just going to bulldoze that whole road and then make sure it connects on the side. I like things to be even. Okay, actually we'll just connect it all the way over. Okay. Um... going on over here. I wonder if we can make a road from over here. Oh, we can. Okay. That's pretty interesting, actually. Oh. Oh, there's a bridge? Wait, that's so pretty. Wait, whoopsie. I did not mean to make that road. Um. Whoops. Okay. I'm gonna bulldoze this random road I just made. Um, and I definitely want to connect this somehow. Oh, I really like that. That's that's really pretty. I think this area might be really nice as residential because it's like right around the, the water. Let's see. Maybe we can also have some shops. Like waterfront homes and shops over here. Okay. Let's take a look and see what we have to do next. We have to zone some residential and have 10 houses. 
Um, why don't we connect this street over here to this road and have this one over here as well. I'm going to add one more line from the highway. Just kind of break this up. Oh wait, I think I like this. Um, let's add some more cross streets so we can make some neighborhoods over here. I like the idea of like waterfront homes. I think that would be really pretty. Chat, let me know if you guys have any ideas. Okay. Oh, I cannot create a smooth enough terrain. Can I do this? Maybe these can be like some really nice homes over here. like I can make a hole through there as well. <laughs> okay. Oh, whoopsie. We're on a... We're running out of... Okay, whoopsie. We've drawn too many roads and it's, it took up so much of our money. That's not good. Alright, we need to make houses and zone these residential. Alright, these are going to be residential zoning over here. Hey guys, welcome to the stream. How are you, Hugo? How are you, Sleepy? Look, they have their cute little homes. I like this. Okay, they need some power. Let's get started on that. Um, I want to make it over here and then have this area be industrial. So why don't we have a wind power plant and it needs to connect to the highway. So we need to find where is going to have like the best like collecting like the best uh looks like these are all pretty even i'm gonna put it over here okay there's our power plant and what else we need water um let's see let's see how much we can get 13.93 okay this is gonna be even more that one's really good here 95, 98, 99, 17. Ooh, these are going up. Oh, that's nice. Let's see if there's any more that would be even higher. I think... Over here is probably our best bet. That was a lot of water. Where was it? It was uh, very close. 17. There. Okay, let's have it there. Um, that's pretty good. We're now making a profit. Oh, that's nice. I'm doing okay. Okay, let's take a look. Um see what's next here. Alright, we're gonna be getting power soon. This person, what do they want? They, oh, that makes sense. They want a town hall. And a bit. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, they want some commercial. That makes sense. We should get started on that. 
what else? These people want oh, another water tower. No, I just did water, so they should be good now. What do you want? These little people. All right, take it to town hall. Yes, we do want a town hall. Town hall is important. All right, let's go ahead and build a town hall. I think a town hall will be really pretty in like the middle of the um, the town. All right, so why don't we put it maybe like here or so? Or here? Yeah, there we go. All right, and let's see. They want zone commercial for 10 or more buildings. So I'm gonna make some commercial zones. We can have some shops. Um, oh, we can make, name our town. Chat, what do you think I should name my town? We named the region Captain's Valley. Um, and we can rename it from Brakeman's Folly. All right, commercial. I'm gonna make this area here commercial. I think that would be really cute, having some shops next to the town hall, make like a little city square. So, you know, let me know what you think. Yeah, there are a lot of trees. That'll probably change though as we're developing this area. So just keep that in mind. Um, okay. I'll probably want to add in some parks too at some point. Industrial, so I'm gonna leave the other part of the map for that. Okay, look at all those chickens. Should we name it uh, Chicken Chicken Forest? <laughs> okay, I don't see any chickens, but I'm here for it. All right, let's see how we're doing here. We have residential demand. They want more. There's demand for uh, medium wealth houses. And there's less demand for shops. So, and then there is demand for factories. So why don't we add in some factories? We'll make this area residential um, and hopefully that will get things started there. order to get some higher wealth homes we need to add in some parks or something like that so let me see if I can add something in uh, parks perfect oh these are so cute all right so they have blacktop park uh, swings playground rides playground a ride playground that's so cool I would love a playground like that a barbecue pit a barbecue pavilion can I afford it water park playground ooh I want to add one of those. A small field, small field of parking, medium field of parking. Let's see. Uh, oh, there's also like sports areas, public tennis court, basketball court, volleyball court, skate park, soccer field, baseball field. In nature, we have this pond. Oh, the pond is so cute. I think I want to add the pond maybe oh I think I need to add some more roads maybe the pond can be like in the middle of town or like over here yeah that's cute okay what if we also add in maybe what's this oh that's so pretty a path colorful path park tall tree row oh we should definitely add in some trees trees along the streets are so pretty uh, actually, wait. Let's see the other options. Treeland Parkway. A plaza. Flower plaza. We could add a plaza next to... Ooh, a, a sculpture garden? A, let's put the sculpture garden next to the town hall. Oh, look at it! 
Oh, our town is really coming together. Oh, this is so cute. Aw. Okay, let's see how we're doing here. We have... Demand is going up for more uh, modern income homes. And there's less demand for industrial. So, oh, that really went up. Okay, let's take a look over here. Um, sure, we can learn more about the budget. All right, you don't have to, for it to be in the red to learn more about your budget. We're doing really well, actually. This is really good. Um, okay, let's see. Expenses column. We barely have any expenses. We should try to add in maybe some more, like a fire station, health station, stuff like that. Okay. Do, do, do. Bond measure. We have cash, so I don't think we need to do that. Um, actually, I will be right back.
Hey guys, I'm back. Thank you so, so much for waiting. So, um, let's see. Let's get back into the game. And it's not picking it up. Now is it picking it up? Let's see. Oh, okay. There we go. We're good. Okay. All right. This shows how much we have to spend. We are making money though, so we're doing okay. Um, so we can close out of this and just keep going. All right. Why don't we add in maybe like a fire department or something? We don't have that yet. So wait, what just happened? I heard something. I feel like we've already like filled up this area. Let's see. Something about sewage. Oh, we don't have a sewage plant. We need to do that. Let's. Um. No, we don't want the wind blowing it that way. But like. Hmm. I guess we'll have to. Oopsie. All right. Let's connect the road here. Upgrade. Oh my god, what is going on? Oh, it's a good thing, I think. More jobs. Um, it's upgrading. Perfect. Let's take a look. We have... Um, let's see what else. Why don't we add in some other government buildings? Things are going really well here, actually. Uh, sure. That though. Okay, increasing the land value. We've done that. Alright, um, use the land value map. What's this? This one? Alright, perfect. This is negative. Building wealth high. Alright, these are gonna be our high wealth areas, so why don't we. This is good for like medium wealth. We actually don't have any high wealth areas. So we need to add in some more, um, I think like parks and stuff in order for that to happen. Mass transit. Okay, people want mass transit. I can give them mass transit. We have power. We have, we have a water tower. We're good on that. We have sewage. We have a government town hall. We, do we have waste disposal? Not. Okay, let's try to add that in. Put it outside the borders. Uh, we'll put it over here for other utilities. Okay, uh, what else? Garbage is available. Fire department. Let's add a fire department. Why don't we add that maybe like over here or something? It's pretty central around. What else? We have a bunch of other money, so let's see. Maybe a clinic? Oh, we don't have enough money for that. And let's see. Maybe we can upgrade the taxes. have enough for a clinic. Yes, injured sims, we must save their lives. Um, we can put them here. 
Perfect. Yay, we can save their lives now. Police I'm kind of starting to get to the point where I'm like, okay, like, what is happening here? There's only two deaths per day. That's pretty good. Um, there's no crimes. We have a zero crime rate. Oh, we need a school. That's really important. Our, our children need to have a school. All right, once we have enough money for that, we're going to go ahead and build one of those. Um, and then the police station will be next. And I know they really want, um, like, uh, buses or streetcars or something. Streetcar depot. Oh, it looks like we need to upgrade some of the roads. We've got a lot going on here. This is pretty cool. We have a lot of demand for... They really want some more. All right, let's go ahead... Commercial business is not getting enough. Okay, we really need to do more zoning for residential. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. We're gonna zone all of this residential. Oh, oopsie. Those are roads. Are there more areas we can put in? Let's, why can't we do something there? We need another road. Oh, there we go. Cannot create a smooth enough terrain for a road there. Well, now what? What? Does that mean? Hmm. But I want residential. Can I not make this residential? What's going on? High industrial demand. Okay, um, I guess we'll add in some more industry. We can zone this all industrial over here. Looks like I need to make some more cross streets or something. Let's go ahead and make this area industrial. All right, let's make some more residential neighborhoods. I think we can connect this area over here. some more over 
over here, but it like won't let me because these are not. Mm. Let's go ahead. We have this whole big area over here. Oh, shoot. That's on fire. Right? No? Yes? Alright, what's going on here? shack soon getting my dream home they're gonna be renovating that's definitely gonna go on fire that's not good um let's take a look what else do we have going on we need to add in some more parks or something to help with the property values i think that we should do like a like a little tot lot or something i think that would be really cute I think I want to add that maybe there's this area over here and um, there's room over here for that too and maybe we can throw in another one like over here. Parks are really cute and it'll make the kids happy. Once we have enough money from that, which it looks like we do, we can actually go ahead and set up a, oh is that density? Looks like we need to upgrade some of the roads. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can road upgrade will it do that automatically now I wonder if that's what the red means these are like busy yeah let's go ahead these are higher density we're gonna go ahead and take care of this now have the money for it we might as well looks like that's going on oh okay what else is something on fire there's a couple pizza places i like the names See what else is going on. This needs to upgrade this bridge. Is everything else good? Oh, we got traffic over here. Let's upgrade that. Um, everything else is looking pretty good. Oh, that's on fire. That's not good. What's this? Quick is okay. Workers. Okay. Quick and dirty. It's a nail salon that's on fire. Okay. Hopefully it can be revitalized. Um, let's see what else. Fire. Small fires everywhere. We need more fire trucks. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can... Can we upgrade the fire station? Edit. Um, looks like we only have one fire station. So let's see. Maybe we can add in... More. Same sign. More. Twice as fast. Okay, let's put that in. And then let's go ahead and add in some more garages so that we can add. Another fire at this auto shop? Oh, that's not good. Um, and then this is an abandoned building. So let's go ahead and bulldoze this abandoned building. Don't need that. And I think we'll go ahead and replace that. Fire on your side of the fence. Is there anything else that we have? They need freight to operate. Okay, so let's see. They need, do we need more industrial? We have freight. Maybe we have to add in some more. It looks like there's still a demand for that. Let's go ahead and add in these areas as um, industrial and see if that helps enough. Okay, let's try that. We're gonna try to increase more residential. 
and they, oh yeah, that's right, they want mass transit. Let's see. Maybe I can add in another fire station in like the industrial side town. It looks like a lot of things are going on in this area and see if maybe we can, um, yeah. Okay, let's see. We have enough for, uh, we were going to add in police. Let's see, police, we have no crimes. Let's, let's focus on schools. We don't have any schools and these kidney schools. That's going to definitely help increase our land value as well. So why don't we make the school over here? That would be really cute. Um, school bus stop. Let's add those all over. We have uh, schools. Another bus stop over here. Another bus stop here. These kids. Yeah. Got one like each grouping. I hope that's enough. Alright. I think these people are really happy now. Guide me. Specialize in education. Yeah, let's let's do that. We just added a school bus stop. Okay. Public library. Ooh, yes, absolutely. Let's definitely put in a public library. Where do we have room for that? Um, I think it would be... We have room that's on top of a house. We don't want to do that. But we do have room behind the school. So maybe we can add something like that in there. Or why don't we add it behind the town hall? Let's put it there. Okay, we've got that. Let's see what else. We wanted mass transit. People really wanted that. Um, we don't have enough for uh, that yet, but we can put in a shuttle bus depot. So maybe we can put that in um, like here. We need to petition to add bus stops. All right, we should definitely add some in in the industrial section to help people get to work. A bus stop there, or uh, yeah, a bus stop here, bus stops along these roads, the bus stops in the neighborhoods, help the kids get to work and school, here, 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 I'm just doing random stuff. These kids need a bus stop too. There's neighborhoods down here and they don't have anything. So let's add in a bus stop for them. Let's see what's going on. Lots of health issues. Oh, that's not good. Why don't we add in another clinic? Let's see where we have room. Let's add in one um, over here. Perfect. I hope that's enough. Okay, great. And then let's add in a bus stop now for the kids over in this area. More fires. Fire in the city. Another fire? Exploding barrel core? What? Why? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's take a look. Maybe we can add in another, let's see, what's here? What do they want? Okay. We need a department of education and another classroom or two. Okay, we can do that. We can make that work. We are out responding to fires. We're gonna add in, what else can we add? Do we have room for another? We do not. But maybe we can add another for the other one. Make another building for this one. Ready to respond to fires? Perfect. Add these in. We have a lot of fires going on. Not enough simoleons. We're out of simoleons? Oh, that's not good. Okay. Well, hmm. let's take a look. What we really need are... We need a lot more residential. This is abandoned. Let's go ahead and bulldoze this. We don't need that. And they can just go ahead and replenish that. Let's go ahead and add in some more roads uh, if we can and see if we can upgrade some more, make some more neighborhoods. I think maybe we can add in some more neighborhoods over here. Um, we really need to. And we're out of money, I think. Whoopsie. Um, how do I undo? I think it'll be okay. We really need to. Alright, let's go ahead and zone this for residential. Residential, please move in. Perfect. We're like 
running out of space though, I think. But that's not good. I know, it's crazy. It's gone by really fast. I'm trying to balance it all, but at the same time, like, I feel like in some ways, oh, what's this? Uh, like, there's just so much going on. Let's see, what's going on here? Okay, I want to do a fireworks show for everyone. Um, come on, we have a fire station. We're going to do this mission. It will cause fires. Uh, sure, let's try it. Okay, let's have less than five fires. Let's see, this is a fire already. Oh, boy. Shoots first cafe. Oh, that's not good. What else? All right, let's try to upgrade the um, because we're about to have way more fires. So let's see if we can add in. I don't have enough simoleons. We're gonna need to raise taxes. Sorry, buddy. All right, let's go see what's going on here. I'm very sorry about those people, but we need money, and you guys want stuff. Let's see if we can upgrade this. We still don't have enough money. We need money. How do we get money? I think it's like Department of Education to City Hall. Let's see if we can add a Department of Education. Department of Education. We need $15,000. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. How are we making money? That's the better question. Income from residential, commercial, and industrial. Okay. more money. Let's take a look. I actually only have a few more minutes, just so you guys know. Um, I will be ending more money, more problems. Yeah, exactly. We need a Department of Finance. Okay. We need a Department of Finance. We also need a Department of Education. Let's see about adding in the Department of Education first. I know that that's very important. And we're like running out of space already. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is crazy. How do people do this? Maybe I did too much. I think I'm doing pretty well for our first time. This is my first time doing a city management. I'm pretty happy with this. Approval shared with Captain Valley. Okay. Chicken Forest. <laughs> Forgot that that's the name. All right, let's see. We need 500 students in one day. How do we have no students? Where are the kids? Let's see, have less than five fires. Okay, at the Department of Finance at City Hall. Um, just don't, I don't know where we're gonna put that. We need a Department of Finance. We are not approved, we need to upgrade City Hall. So we need more residents. We need twice the amount of residents actually in order to, that's no shoppers, out of here. Bye bye, no shoppers. Perfect. Bye bye. You're gonna become Are these abandoned. I cannot build those. This building is on fire. Oh my god. Any other abandoned buildings? We're like almost out of space. We have one more abandoned building, and that's right here, and we can't build those yet because it's on fire. Yeah, I do want to learn about approval rating. Okay, my approval rating is pretty good. This is awesome. Okay, let's take a look. Residential, they want good places to shop, like the new city buildings, lots of fun things to do. People keep dying, it's horrible. Too many injuries, we're moving. Okay, so it looks like we definitely need more hospitals and clinics. Um, we can we can make that happen. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. There's another one on the Oh my gosh. Keep dying, it's horrible. Health map. Okay, let's take a look and see. This is the health map. This is where people are getting one injured sim. That's the clinic. Oh wait, there's another injured sim. So it looks like maybe we need to add a clinic to that area of town. And then, what else? Maybe over here as well. Okay, we already have a clinic over there. Oh, that person died. Oof. Okay, um... Well, we already have one over there. Looks like people are doing really well over there. Looks like we need to add... Let's add a clinic over here. 
I think that will help. Okay, let's take a look. Three deaths per day. Let's see what's going on. How are the roads doing? That needs to be upgraded over here. Let's see, Cape Lake Residence. Upgrade the roads. Let's upgrade this road, this road, and this road. Looks like they definitely need. There's so much traffic here. Have less than five fires. We did it. Okay, great. We now have a bunch more money. Oh, this area is getting crazy. we can do. Where else? Needs more support. This area in town just really needs more. Okay, there's a lot going on here. Mayor's house. Everything else is going pretty well now. I'll see if I can upgrade. There's a lot going in over here. Okay, let's come out of this one. already done. We need more. We, we need a lot more with, um, let's see, let's see what's going on here. Okay. Cool. Rather, larger school would be better. Okay, Plapa High School. Let's see. 500 students in one day. Department of Finance City Hall. Let's go ahead and do the Department of Finance. Uh, we can't. We need to upgrade City Hall first. Wait a second, it said no cost. Oh. Okay, I will have to get off very, very soon. I'm almost out of time. Looks like we have some abandoned buildings, so let's go ahead and bulldoze those so that we're not using up what we don't need here. Okay, let's see. Oops. Let's see. That's gone. We have an abandoned building. Abandoned building. I think that's everything now. Okay, let's go ahead and clear that out. Zones. Power is doing pretty good. Water level is, we have a lot of excess and we have really clean water, that's amazing. Okay, let's see if we can, water table map, revolution map, health map, can we sell our excess? Um, okay, sewage, we need a sewage treatment plant, not approved. We need a department of utilities to be able to do that. Let's see, that's another fire, oh no. There's so many people that are doing fires. The mayor's house. Okay, let's put the mayor's house. It'll raise medium land wealth. Um, where should I live? I'm the mayor. I think I want to live right over... I'll join the people. I want to live right here. Sorry, guys. 
I don't like how that turned it the other way. That's kind of annoying. Um, let's see, what else? Mayor's Mansion. That's cool. Waste disposal. I'm pretty sure we don't have one of those yet, right? Did we ever make a waste disposal? You smoke it. Rhyme Unlimited. That's not that. Alright, let's see. Do we have waste disposal? Did I make that? Oh, no. We have, we have a garbage dump. We're good on that. No, we have fire stations. 18 out of 19 fires burned are done per day. We have... We need another clinic. These people are getting really sick. And another thing to support this. Okay, let's see. Looks like this area... Someone is very unhappy here. Maybe they're sick. So let's add in a clinic right here. Feeling sick returning home came from City Hall. Okay, you're now covered. You have this. <laughs> they can demolish the ugly power plants. Okay, no police station. We do now have crime. So we're going to put some police station in. Uh, let's try to see. Maybe, I guess, like right here. Okay, perfect now have police coverage and we need to upgrade we need to well we need to put the I think the bus I don't think we have school buses over here all right we're gonna make sure that happens really cute. Do we need one on like every street in order to make people happy? Hmm. Why are like none of our kids enrolled? That's alarming. Okay, let's see. It will be now. You will go to school. You will get an education. <laughs> you need this. Let's see if that helps. The public library we already did. The high school, we need 500 students in the day in the region in order to do our high school. Mass transit, um, we did do the shuttle bus already and we can add some bus stops to some other areas. This area is very busy all the time. So if we had some public bus stops, that would really help. There's a lot of traffic. What else? This area gets really busy. I'm gonna try to have some in each area. Average wait 53 minutes. Oh yeah, I'd be mad too. All right, hopefully that helps. Boats, we're not ready for the boathouse yet. And I, I actually really need to go. Okay, we still have a lot more for that. Let's see if I can add in like a quick park or two to help with the, they really want some more like high barbecue pavilion. Water park. Yeah, a water park sounds great. Let's add in a water park. Um, yeah, let's put one there. Let's put one. Uh, maybe there's, there seems to be some lacking over here. Let's see how we're doing now. I feel like we just made a lot of really good changes to the area. It's so big already. This is crazy. Okay. We have... Can we add in our Department of Finance yet? Mm, not yet. We have to upgrade City Hall first. Oh 
and we can't upgrade City Hall until we have more residents. So, what's this? City specialization? Mining. Oh yeah, that's right. Mining. Okay, where we... Okay, I guess in the next one, more if I'm working best system, they can get across town. And they have... They're happy. Okay, great. They want... The bus is too sick. Crowded, so... Calling in sick. That's not good. Let's see. Okay. Let's take a look at this next time. I'm going to go ahead and save the game and we'll come back another time. This was a really good stream and I think that we're definitely going to do this another time. This was really cool. And again, let me know if you guys are interested in doing some sort of multiplayer. There is a co-op version. All right. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.